Hey guys, it's Marianne from Thrive with your top tip. And today I wanted to show you how you can take the data that is collected from your Microsoft Forms and use it in other ways to visually support the points that you're trying to make about the results. So I've got this form here, it has five questions and I'm going up here, you can see I've got 53 responses. So over here, what we get are a few different formats. So I can look at the individual results here, which will show me the exact responses per form that someone's completed. I've also got this one, which is a spreadsheet, and that will show me all of the individual responses in a, in a spreadsheet, which I can then use to create charts and graphs and uh, tables that I could use in other formats as well. But a quick shortcut that you could try if you haven't seen this already, is that we get this overview section. And now I can see I've had 53 responses, on average, it's taken people three minutes to fill it out and it's been live for 690 days. But as an example, I can take a snip of this section. I could take a snapshot or a, a clipping and I could insert that into a PowerPoint presentation, an email, a report to visually support whatever I'm putting in as text around it. Now that would be a static shot. So if people are still completing my form, it's not going to update, but Rather than me having to go in and make graphs and charts, Forms has done the work for me. Particularly if I am not worried about changing the colors to my branding. Now, normally I would say you should always brand everything, but if you're in a hurry or it's a large group of stuff, so you can see here we've got quite a lot of choices. I don't have enough brand colors for that anyway. So this way I could just, rather than spending an hour putting together a chart, fiddling about with the colors, I can just take a quick snip, pop it in and get on with my report or presentation. It's something to consider and you should definitely check it out because it comes in lots of different formats depending on the type of question you have and it will give you a, another sort of break or way of in providing that information to somebody that might help them to understand your point more clearly. Give it a go.